and lift off. Remember when we talked about space intersections? Yeah, and I'm still waiting to go to Jupiter. Right, you've already learned about orbital mechanics, but in order to get to Jupiter, you also need to know about orbital maneuvers, which are burns your rocket's engine will need to make to help your spacecraft change orbits. Why do I need to know that? Because getting to certain locations in space requires a little mapping, or else you might go off course. All right, but make it snappy. Let's start with an example that's a little easier than going to Jupiter. Launching to Leo and then transferring to Geo. Who are Leo and Geo? No, no, no. They're the names of orbits around Earth. Leo stands for Low Earth Orbit, and Geo stands for Geosynchronous Orbit. I've heard of Geo. That's the circular orbit over 22,000 miles above Earth's equator. That's the one. To get to Geo, you first launch into Leo, where you will stay until your rocket's upper stage takes you the rest of the way. By using one of the orbit intersections that we discussed earlier. So let's say I make it from Earth to Leo, then how do I get to Geo? To make an intersection change, your rocket will need to start its engine, also called an engine burn, which will require fuel and oxidizer. You must execute your burns at precise locations in the orbit, because the burn will change the opposite side of the orbit. My rocket will be changing the shape of the orbit that I'm in? Yeah, but it's a good thing because it orbits new shape will have curved to create an intersection to geo, transferring you to the destination. Cool, so if I'm at the apogee, my rocket's burn will be changing the perigee. Look who's teaching who. Moving on. So to get to Jupiter, you'll need to use an orbital maneuver to escape Earth. And transfer to other planets. But instead of trying to hit an orbit, you'll want to hit an object moving within that orbit. So would I plan to hit Jupiter? Not quite. Since planets are in motion, you need to go to where Jupiter will be, not where it is right now. Like a football player throwing the ball ahead of a receiver. Great example. Also, it's going to take a lot of energy to get to Jupiter. I am feeling a little low on energy. Let's go to lunch. Not energy for you, energy for your rocket. To efficiently get you to Jupiter, use another type of orbital maneuver, a slingshot. To do this, you launch from Earth, go into an orbit around the sun, and then use the planets around the sun as your slingshots. To gain momentum and use less of my fuel supply. When you get in orbit around the sun and closer to a planet, its gravity will pull you towards it. And I can use that gravity as a slingshot to get to where I really want to go. I think it's time. Am I ready to go yet? Launch away. Jupiter won't know what hit it. <laughs>